probably the last time I saw her, probably I was eight. And then I see her again, I was 15. Yeah, so about nine years. I don't know how to explain it, but it, it, you feel like home again with being with your mother. Ta's a great example of the work that JFS does to build community. Ta came to the country as a refugee himself. He really goes above and beyond, wanting to make sure that clients are connected not only to the basic needs, but also to a larger sense of community. He serves on the Mayor's Cultural Communities Board, helping represent the refugee communities to make sure that their voice is heard. He also started a soccer team for clients. We have uh, players from Congo, Iraq, Burma, probably Vietnam. We don't discriminate based on where, which country they come from, but we invite whoever uh, interested in playing. It's not just sport, but sport more into more, more than sports, uh, learning about each other. These extra activities that Ta is doing uh, really tie in well to, to JFS's values and working with clients beyond just providing the bare minimum of services. We're really investing in the community as a whole. And that's really, I think, um, the essence of how we do what we do. It's not one person doing one job, it's the entirety of our community coming together to serve the needs of the vulnerable in our community.